Hey everybody. Uh, one of the things that we hear about Google Chat is that sometimes you just forget to start it. Even if you have it pinned to your taskbar down there, sometimes you just forget to click it to start it up. Well, today we're going to show you how to get Windows to start up Google Chat every time you turn on your computer. And this doesn't just work for Google Chat. You want Outlook to start all the time, we could do that. If you have a Chrome profile you want to start all the time, we'll do that as well. The steps are going to be the same. I'm just going to show you Google Chat. So. Um, in Windows 11, when we finally upgrade these things, it's actually just a toggle. Here, it's gonna be a command line. It's very simple, very easy, so we'll walk you through it. So first things first, you can see here I'm on my chat page, and I'm gonna to go to my three dots, and go to more tools, and click on create shortcut. Now, I like Google Chat to open up in a window, so I'm gonna check this box as well, and hit create. And there you go. And you can see it also just pinned it to the taskbar for me, because I said to open up as a window. Now we need to uh, go down here to my search bar. You're gonna type in run. Click enter. Here you're gonna type in the following. You're gonna type in shell colon startup. So shell colon startup and you're gonna hit okay. Now this folder here that just opened up, it's a folder that Windows looks at when you start the computer. And basically it looks in here and says, is there anything you want me to start up extra? There's nothing in here. And this is what we're gonna do is we're gonna add Google Chat and whatever else we want into this folder. So now I'm going to right click on my File Explorer and just open up File Explorer. I'm gonna kind of drag stuff around so it's a little bit easier to see here. So anytime you create a shortcut, it goes automatically to the desktop. So I'm gonna click on desktop over here and you can see there's my Google Chat and I could just drag it and drop it in. Now you actually have the option here. This is a preference thing. If you go to properties, you could actually force it to be in a normal window or total maximized window. I'll go maximize so it goes full screen so I see it. Remember to click apply and then okay. So now every time I start my computer, Google Chat is going to start up. I don't have to worry about starting it. If I want to add email, if I want my email to start all the time, I'll just drag that in there. Uh, if I go down here, when you created your Chrome profiles, you can see I have them down here. I want mine to start up all the time. Just drag it, drop it in, and that's it. Now you're telling Windows when you start, it's going to look in this folder and it's going to start these three things automatically for you. And that's all you have to do. Once again, when we get to Windows 11, we'll make another video, but it's just a toggle switch. And that's all you have to do to get stuff to start up automatically in Windows 10. If you guys have any questions, let me know. Thanks for watching.